holding hand by hand with Jimmy Driving around London in his blue mini Every day is abundant, every day is easy Hey, I love you Hello everybody, welcome to the Wendy's family. If this is the first time in the channel, hi, I'm Wendy. I'm here guys, no makeup, like dressed like really to just stay at home and show you a normal day of a pregnant woman. I'm actually right now 35 weeks, 35 weeks with a big, big belly and I cannot even tell you like how excited I am. I cannot really wait to you know get it out finally and yeah so now what i want to do is i'm going to do a quick workout i'm gonna use this machine i'm going to do this workout because i feel like i need it this belly really needs you know to exercise i heard also that if you exercise during pregnancy you have a great chance that your labor is less painful so that's a good news <laughs> labor less painful and also i have two things that i'm waiting for both of them are for the baby shower that we are getting ready to celebrate this sunday they are some decorations for the house first of all and also some brazilian you know treats and things that i go just for whoever wants to come in and say hi to a baby shower but it's gonna be something very like intimate very private well it's not gonna be private because i'm gonna do a vlog about it but it's literally gonna be just jamai's family because we are just going to do a little reception at home and later we are going to go to a restaurant and just have a quiet meal nothing much going on i'm going to exercise i um, don't know what, <laughs> what can happen like i usually do this every day i'm already sweating i thank god that it rained finally in london so it's raining finally because it was getting like too much like the heating was way too much and in the last weeks of pregnancy i'm feeling very hot i have a lot of liquid liquids i'm retaining a lot of liquids and i just need to get it out okay i could be in bed right now because my feet are swelling but at the same time i don't want to just make excuses and be in bed or whatever like i've been editing really hard these days i've been doing a lot for the channel in the channel with you guys i've been doing a lot with my partner i enjoy time with him a lot i've been you know trying to meet friends take advantage of my days as much as i can because soon i know everything's gonna be over <laughs> like wendy as you know enough it's not gonna be Wendy no more it's going to be taking care of someone else but I don't want to let my work on the side so I understand that YouTube is my work now so I'm a youtuber and I don't only have this channel I started with another channel um, the link is down below I have an audiobook channel a love attraction channel and I'm thinking in do the same kind I'm thinking no, I decided already I'm gonna do another same kind of content channel in Spanish as well because I speak Spanish, my family speaks some of them Spanish, my mom and my brother and the rest speaks Portuguese so none of them actually can understand none of these videos and they are very upset, they are like oh I want to understand, I want to know what's going on so I have to start the channel in Spanish and this for you that maybe want to learn Spanish or that maybe know a little bit of Spanish or that know Spanish and prefer to have the content in Spanish you're also going to enjoy it so that's the news so far and now I'm just going to get ready to work out, so hope you enjoy that! <laughs> And now I'm using two because I go stronger, I don't know, I actually find it easy now with two. Okay guys, I'm back. I don't know if you can see how I'm actually sweating. Sweat is dripping through my body right now. And it's because this machine is great. And with one more resistance, you do double than you're supposed to. <laughs> so I highly recommend this machine. Ah, 
Do some exercise at home, whatever it is, you know what I mean? It's important to feel healthy. Keep on track, okay? Alright guys, this was my workout, now I'm going to have a shower, get all this sweat out of my face, my body, can you see that? Who said that pregnant body is not beautiful? <laughs> For real, I feel beautiful. I having, you know, I just wish I was sweating less, sweating or swollen less, so I could feel a bit more like myself. But rather than that, I'm grateful for pregnancy. I'm grateful for this life growing inside of me. And even though I know it's taking a lot of what I was, this is still me. It's I think the most empowered version of me. And for all the women out there that lose confidence after pregnancy, that I know it happens, it happened to me, it will happen at some point. Just get, get on to it because this is what God gives you. This is the body you have. You don't have any other one, so take care of it as if it was, you know, your last chance because at the end of the day, you only have one. So if you don't take care of it now, no one is gonna take care of it for you. So at the end of the day, you know what to do. You know what feels better. You know that there is always a new day to start, okay? So if you haven't worked out yesterday, try to do it today, try to do it tomorrow. Try to do it a little bit every day, even if it's 20 or 30 minutes, like I, I, I just did now. But don't lose, don't lose your days, you know what I mean? Get, get on track. But now I'm gonna have a shower. I'll get back to you soon. Bye! <laughs> Oh hi guys, hello, I'm back, I um like this because I just had a shower and I put um, some creams and things in my face just so we can get absorbed and you know I can get, give to myself this little spa treatment even though I'm at home, you know what I mean? Like sometimes I like to do this by myself, sometimes I like to do this with my partner, sometimes I like to do this if I had a friend to hang out and do it together, I would love to as well. And what is happening right now is like, I'm going to talk to you a bit about the importance of self-love, self-acceptance and also self-care, okay? So while I'm doing this, this white that I have in my face is part of the cream that I just used, it's like a serum. So yes. I'm going to literally groom myself, okay, at the same time. Because grooming is very important for you to see yourself beautiful and for other people to see yourself like you take care of yourself as well, okay? So I like to groom myself, take away anything that is not supposed to be there, any piece of hair or anything. I met the granny of Jamai the other day and I asked her, what was, is the one advice that you will give to a young person? And she literally said, self-love. Like, learn to love yourself, learn to put yourself as a priority. And I think that's so wise, so wise and so smart that she actually said that. Because I believe the same, self-love is the most important thing because if you don't feel good with yourself, if you don't love yourself, you can literally love anyone else. When you love yourself, you learn to filter anything that is not supposed to be there. I don't know if these grooming things are things that men usually do as well. For women, it's like a necessity because a couple of weeks that you stay without looking at yourself in the mirror and actually see spots and things that you have, that's a time that you're gonna be looking really rough and you don't want that to happen. They gave me this head towel when I went to the hairdresser in Headmasters and I really really appreciate it, thank you so much, thank you, shout out to them. It's really useful though because I just get out of the shower, wash my hair and now it's looking nice. Great, I'm very hot, I bought this 
fun the other day. I feel like it will help me just so the cream can get absorbed and everything. And yeah, mm, give a bit of freshness because I'm actually sweating right now, even though I just get out of the shower. But yeah, guys, what can I tell you? The life of a pregnant woman is it's hard I'm always hungry like I'm hungry right now I'm thinking I'm gonna eat something and I I want to do a recipe today for the channel I want to bake a cake I need to bake a cake and I want to bake a cake but I want to do it in a separate video because I started a new section this month that is called Wendy's Kitchen so I want to get a few recipes in there and just get some things different for the channel also have this new fitness section coming as well and this is just chatting I'm just literally chatting I'm listening to affirmations in the background I believe affirmations are very important and now I'm going to quickly do my nails because they're looking really rough I'm just gonna take away the stuff that I have in here and um, put some new you know just natural color because I don't want to have color too much I heard that the Queen and the princess of England and in general anyone important they only use neutral colors and only use like nude or transparent because it looks really rough when you have a, a color like red or something like that and it's coming off and it's important to have your nails done these kind of things are things about self-love that I haven't even thought before, um, you know, haven't even realized how important they are and also put your feet, feet up once in a while because it's so hard to, you know, just create a new life. These are things that I didn't know before I was pregnant. And I feel like sometimes we blame, or blame our mothers and things for things that happen. But we don't actually understand how much these women have made for us, have done for us. It's no excuse though, but at the same time, yeah, you need to be really aware that what's happening in the life of a human person can be like very different. I think the, the package is here, one sec. Hello? Yes. Yes, one sec. Hi. The cochinas. I got in here. These are some Brazilian treats that I ordered for the baby shower so I'm, I'm, I need to find a space for this in the fridge right now I don't, literally don't have let me do that try to find a space for this it actually happened in a moment where I was not expecting it oh, I'm sorry about this tripod I'm sorry this tripod is a shit I need to buy a new one as soon as possible I actually ordered one already waiting for it to come back now is a dilemma because I literally have no space in the fridge I have no space in the fridge to put this I feel like I need to I need to do my bless right now As I was saying before, I'm always hungry, okay? Life of a pregnant woman, this is what it is like. You feel always hungry, you feel always like sweating, you feel always like <laughs> walling, all of that. So I'm going to eat, let me put you back where you were. I'm going to eat a salad that I have prepared in the fridge. I prepared this yesterday, so it's still fresh. A salad and a yogurt. I love yogurt now, because I'm pregnant, even though this is something. <laughs> Oh, it's it's no, it's broken. My phone is broken. Shit, I just bought this. I gave you a good review, but now I'm gonna give you a bad review. How it broke so fast. No, fuck this. Thank you. Okay, still works, but now it's broken, but yeah, it's fine. Thanks God, it still works. I need to be careful with this, it just dropped twice. 
in literally a space of no time. So yeah, I'm gonna eat this salad while I keep talking to you because I'm hungry, okay? I am really hungry. Eee, I hate this tripod. Okay. Mm, still, still good. So as I was saying, mm, self-love is so important. All kind of self-love. Take care of yourself, groom yourself, feed yourself, nourish yourself, repeat to yourself good things that you wanna, you wanna do, and assume that, that you are great, you know what I mean? Like, you are great. You can do anything, anything you want. Absolutely anything. Like, who will say that I'll be here sitting, talking to you? A few years ago, when I was like, really frustrated. Guys, as soon as I start eating, the baby started moving. So as a mother, I believe your job is to give, give to your child everything you didn't have, but also, <laughs> also let them do whatever they want to do. Let them do your, their young mistakes and discover their young lives. Because as parents, we are a channel, we bring these people to the world and then it's up to them to discover their mission and their purpose. They purpose in life because everyone everyone should have a purpose and if they don't there's something wrong with them. Live without a purpose is better don't even live, you know. I'm a very sentimental deep person and at some point in my life I didn't have a purpose. I thought I did, but it was the wrong purpose, so I was feeling really bad. And at some point I even pray and I asked to God, God, if you don't want me here for some reason, if you don't want to show me what's my purpose, just take me away. <laughs> I remember doing this because I talk to God very often, all the time, obviously in my mind, but sometimes I really pray, like I go on my knees and I pray, I, I speak with him. And I told him that, and then literally about a week later I find out that I was pregnant. I don't believe my only purpose is being a mother though. I believe I have a deeper purpose, which I always thought it was like being a writer, being creative and help people because I had a, such a complicated life that I feel like sometimes I see people with such an easy life and they are so depressed and I think like, like why are you depressed? Like, you know what I mean? I could help them somehow. I could be like a great life coach, something like that. And that's what I want to do in a deeper level, you know, in a level where I can really help another people to be the best versions, the best version of themselves. But I only can do that by being the best version of myself, because if I'm not the best version of myself, then who is going to care? Like, who is going to even care what I have to say? No one is going to even give a shit. And this is the reason why I never started. At a deeper level, I know I have something big to do in this area. <laughs> like my purpose was, at the beginning, like being a great professional, help my family, you know. I want to do something great for the world. I want, I want to, I don't know, build schools in Brazil or in Africa or something. Like, teach the law of attraction, things like that. I always wanted to do like an online course and I know I will do it one day. Like I really wanna do that. Have my feet up because my feet is literally swelling so much right now. I was in the middle of doing my nails and I forgot and I just, I couldn't resist, I needed to eat something. I enjoy eating healthy food. Mm. It's important to give your body good food and exercise. Yeah, give your body what it needs to function at its best. This was great. That was exactly what I needed. Exactly what I needed. And the baby's happy. Ooh, she's happy. She's moving. But yeah, now I'm gonna keep doing my nail a little bit. Okay, just a little bit. Oh, Jesus. I finished to do my nails. They are almost dry. But while they're drying, I'm just gonna stay here and literally read. I'm going to put my feet up. Because 
why not put my feet up a pillow somewhere on my back I feel like you can see if you can see something just ignore it okay um have this little basket with the books I'm reading at the moment so I'm just going to stay here and read for a while and I'm gonna also make sure I highlight the stuff I'm reading which is more important so yeah first of all take care of your body take care of yourself take care of your mind take care of your brain okay brain exercise at least 20 minutes of reading that's what I'm doing now My Amazon package arrived. Let's see what's good in here for me. Why do I feel like I'm not in the camera? I don't know. Let me open, guys. So we got this for the baby shower. We're going to just you know put them up here in the room we're gonna do that tomorrow so that's the vlog for tomorrow oh and we got these baby boxes that we also going to do them tomorrow I'm going to sit down here, put a guided meditation on my phone and I'm going to do that because I feel like my eyes are dropping and I can't really, I can't sleep in any moment. So I'm going to put a meditation on, the baby's moving right now. I'm gonna put a meditation on, 20 minutes maybe, and stay here and relax. I see you in a few days. Thank you for hanging out with me. By the way, I fell asleep before a little bit, not too much, but I did, I did my meditation. Huh? Yeah. Alright guys, I woke up from my meditation, we had dinner, <laughs> and this man came, we had dinner, we enjoyed, and uh, now I'm gonna bake a cake, but yeah. I'm gonna bake a cake. What okay. are you gonna do? I'm gonna go and handle some work. 
and I'll be back with you guys later. It's true, but look at what we're watching because I'm editing this now. This is my next vlog to be edited. Yeah, and he cannot even leave. He has to leave and he cannot leave. He's here like, look at him watching it. I'm out of it. See you later, this guy. But yeah, yeah. Let's go. I'm gonna bake a cake. See you, bye. Yeah, that, that's all right. Then I will tell him that. And then if you come and see you on Sunday, then... Perfect, perfect. And uh, what should I do? Should I call Sally? Hello? 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 Hello, sorry. <laughs> Can you hear me? Oh yeah, it was reconnecting according to my phone. I was saying like, what should I do? Should I call Sally? Because Angel knows. I'm just gonna send the address to Angel. And then I guess they're gonna come together or they're gonna come separated. Hello? Oh my God, I can hear nothing. Ah. Hello? Yeah, I will send. Well, you have the dress, right? They have the dress. Yeah. Okay. No, no, don't worry. It's everything under control. <laughs> yeah, no, he's 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 working as well, and and yeah. I just, um, I am be swollen and that, but rather than that, I'm good. I'm ready for the baby to come out. <laughs> I try, I try, but even like that. You know, there's like a pattern, that, a line that is supposed to follow. Like every week, every two weeks, they measure and it's supposed to be in proportion. But this week just went like three or four times more than it's supposed to. Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, and then. No, I, I changed a little bit my diet because she said that I was low in iron. So I bought like Flora Dix and I started eating red meat again. And, and what she said is like. She's not very worried because it can be for the position of the baby, but she sent me to do a scan anyway, so I will let you know what happened. Yeah. Yeah. Um, no. Yeah, yeah, I think I think that's it. She wanna come up earlier. <laughs> yeah. 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 Very, very. They say she looks very happy. Like the the heartbeat and everything is fine. It's just the the growing that is more than than they expected. Yeah, because I'm small. I'm worried about how is she gonna get out. <laughs> yeah. Okay, Abby. Uh, have a good evening, have a good evening. I will let Yamai know that you called and uh, we're both gonna call Granny and we're gonna speak with her and see what she needs and, and, and what we need to do. Okay, you too. Regards to the girls and I can't wait to see you all on Sunday. <laughs> see you, bye bye. You too, bye. doing the dishes because I already had dinner so I'm doing the dishes so. being a housewife is very difficult no one told me this before I thought it was gonna be chill you know but <laughs> you have your moments then you need to get back to the truck 
I was speaking with the mom of Jamai. She is very excited. We have a baby shower on Sunday. And I guess we're gonna have to do it because and rather than that, everything will be blessed. Because what is faith and hope and desire, anything else can be possible. Just watching my my flowers vase. Some of my flowers died today very abruptly. But now, <laughs> now I'm gonna make a cake. I'm going to make a cake. It's gonna be nice, it's going to be good. Ah. Eu posso até estar ferido, mas nunca destruído. Okay, so I'm going to get all the requisite ingredients I need to bake this cake with this. Yeah, that will that will work, hopefully. So to make this cake, we are going to need self-raising flour, sugar. We are going to need, obviously, cake mixer, hundred one, okay? And we are going to need the butter. And we are going to need is my secret ingredient and I'm going to do a measure here okay so we are going to measure a little bit of our secret ingredients you can use any kind of butter you want okay unsalted butter preferable I don't have space in the fridge fine finally Sorry guys, I can't with the heating, it's too much. Okay, let's go for it. So we've got 200 grams of butter added in there. You may be asking, why is this butter green? I don't know. I don't know. It's just like that. And then we have this other butter. Oops gonna drop it in there this is being out of the fridge for about few hours so it's no cold anymore it's, it's nice you can use it wow be careful okay be careful be careful okay I'm obviously washing my hands because moving with food dealing with food always have to get your hand wash okay um we're going to use the sugar after the butter okay you drop already like whatever butter you want in there drop now the sugar we're gonna put all this much of sugar sugar let me get a no this spoon get this butter with this spoon okay we do the you know, you put the special butter, the normal butter, in there with the sugar. Get all of this out of the way so I can focus on you. We have this, okay? This is really pro, it's really good, really great. Okay, I found it. It was there all the time. I just couldn't see it. But now we are going to plug this just like this. Let me show you what is going on over here. Here, obviously, you got all your butter. All your butter and all your sugar is in there. And we're literally just going to mix this up. We're gonna mix it up, okay? So we make it bigger. Take the rest. Just won't like to miss anything. This butter. I add a drop of water. Usually it's a drop of milk, but I don't have milk right now. Drop of water. In the rest of the eggs, okay. I'm gonna add extra vanilla. Guys, look how good this is looking. Okay, guys. 
Okay guys, this is looking nice so far. It's uh, ready to put it in the oven. Now I am going to quickly clean up this area and uh, prepare the bowl where the cake is going to go in the oven. I use this bowl and I use uh, a little bit of oil, usually olive oil. I don't have olive oil right now. I'm using sesame oil. I drop a little bit in there and a little bit of paper, kitchen paper, clean for just, you know, put it around. When you make sure everything is oily and nice, moist, then is when you're going to just drop your cake. Look at that. Ooh. Yes. So you start like that and you're gonna drop everything in there. Make sure nothing is left over. That's it guys, our cake is ready to go in the oven. The oven is being warmed up for about 10 minutes now, so it's basically warm. And now we are just going to take this how it is and we are going to drop it in the oven. So come with me. Open there. Dropping it there. Okay, make sure it's not I tied up the kitchen all right guys so that time has gone and now it's time to check the cake oh my gosh this cake is huge no how you see how big is this cake hold on hold on hold on what the hell what the hell happened guys have you seen that cake that cake is huge it's not even close to be done yet. It's not done. So I put it another few minutes. I think I add more ingredients, the more quantity that I usually add. And it's just, but it's good. Anyway, we have extra cake now. with the cake. This is the cake, it's ready, okay? It looks a bit burned, but it's not. One side was more done than the other. And uh, look what happened. <laughs> It was an accident in the oven. I don't know what happened. I think I messed up the recipe a little bit. But yeah, now I'm making a salad with tomatoes, lettuce, all that goodness, and some meat. We have some rice with it. So it's time to dinner and after I finish the cake. <laughs> <laughs> No one taught us manhood and um what? the other people came in the For real, like my feet are swelling so much. Looks like I'm, I'm weighing like 200 pounds or something. I just had dinner. Just feel so nice after eating and all of that. And um, just feel like tomorrow is a new day. And now I feel like I wanna take my makeup off. I want to probably have another shower, uh, finish to clean the kitchen, relax, go to bed, edit a little bit of videos and probably read a little bit. 
but I feel naked so I'm sure I'm going to fall asleep straight away and uh, yeah that was all for today thank you for coming with me in a one more day one more day closer for the baby to be here and one more day of adventure for me so thank you so much I appreciate your company thank you for your time make sure you smash the like button if you like it destroy it and uh, comment down below anything you want me to do next or mm, any anything comment anything say hello to me and yeah subscribe don't forget to subscribe click the notifications bell as well so you won't miss any of my next videos and i see you soon i love you so much bye